Hey loves, it is Friday afternoon. Um, first, before I even start this video, I want to say thank you to every single person who reached out to me after my last vlog. It took a lot for me to post that, so thank you for being so accepting and just loving. So thank you, thank you, thank you. But it is Friday, I am dressed. I'm about to go have lunch with one of my yoga classmates and my yoga teacher and another person from the ashram. We're gonna go eat, I believe we're gonna go have some Thai food. I will try to break out the camera and show you guys what I'm gonna have and I think it's gonna be beachfront property so I'll show you a little view I actually used to live in this neighborhood so it's gonna be like going back to my old area I don't know hopefully I don't get nostalgic I hope not all right so I'm gonna go because she's gonna be here soon and I'm always rushing out of this house so I'll talk to you guys in a little bit One. Another Sunday, another park bench. I swear to God, this is becoming a normal thing. Sitting on the park bench talking to myself while people stare at me like I'm crazy. Um, I'm waiting to go teach. Actually, Angie is meeting me today and we're gonna go to eat sushi and explore the neighborhood. So I'm excited about that. There's a police officer staring at me. He probably thinks I'm crazy. Whatever. All right, I'm gonna go before I get arrested for looking like a fucking psycho on the streets. I will talk to you guys in a little bit. to be tourists we're doing a great job at it we really are with this we, camera we have the camera Bunker. <laughs> we have the camera out we're recording we're so, wearing book bags yeah it's like That's tourists. What tourists do we just need an I heart New York show So I just got home and I was like, let me 
record this before I go take a shower because I want to make sure I record this outro. I always forget. But all in all, it was a great weekend. Friday, as you guys saw, I went to have Thai food with some of my yogi friends. And then today, me and Angie went around and explored Brooklyn. Like, she used to go to school very close to where I teach, so she showed me around. We were supposed to go get sushi, but the place ended up being closed. So we went to this little restaurant, and I got chicken and waffle. I was a little disappointed. First off, I think half my waffle was missing. It was like two little triangles, that's it. And then the chicken was a little, mm, like it was bland. And I told Angie, you can tell I don't like it because I'm not making my happy sounds, you know? But then afterwards, we went to this fudge place and we got the most delicious fudge. Mm, so good, so good. But besides that, it was great. I took almost 22,000 steps because we walked around the pier. We sat by the water. It was perfect. Twice this weekend, I got to be around water, which pretty much rejuvenates me because I am a water child. Um, but yeah, it was a good weekend. I taught yoga. It's funny because this weekend, Yesterday, one of my classes had 23 people, and then today, when I taught in Brooklyn, it was only two people, and pretty much the attendance in the gym was really slow today because the gym that I teach at, it's more of like a business area, so it's not very residential, like that little part, and we're having a three-day weekend, and it's like everybody was out of town, but... Um, that day when I had the 23 people, I felt all this energy from the class. It was amazing. And then today with only two people, it's completely like different, you know? But I still have to give each class the same exact energy for myself. Like I can't phone it in if it's only two people because they showed up for a great class and they really enjoyed it. And sometimes it's nice when it is a small group because you can really put your focus on them and check their alignment. And like you know really just hone in on what they need at that moment so yeah so good times good friends good food good fudge good yoga it was a perfect weekend um i know i said it before but i'm going to say it again thank you to every single person who reached out to me after my last video you guys were awesome so i was like i got so much love and support it was a very hard subject for me to bring up because i didn't know how it was going to be taken but of course you this my little circle is amazing so i think every single person you guys are awesome sauce but i'm gonna go take a shower because i is a gross so gross but as always my loves thank you thank you thank you and namaste bye